Hey folks, this is a follow up on the Frank Summer build suspended by KTVU story. Richard Lieberman, Rich Lieberman as he likes to call himself, and we've known each other for a long time, is really upset that the mainstream media stole his Frank Somerville story. Um, and he's right. He basically says here, I work real hard to bring an inside to most of my stories. And it's no joy to see mainstream media newspaper sites owned by billionaires steal my work. So SF Gate, Bay Area News, headquarters, Somerville. All right. And um, that's just, he's also reporting that soon a rebellion at KTVU will start. Frank Somerville is just the tipping point. But if you want some confirmation of what Richard is saying, all you have to do is go to Google News and see if anyone has used his name that only one organization has. And I will click and show you which organization that is. It's me. Oakland News Now is owned by my company, Zenny 62 Media. And that um, has been evident here that I am the, my company is the only one that has bothered to actually truthfully attribute the story to Richard Lieberman. Um, and that's who I got the story from. And I said, I would echo it. And that's what I did. But you tell no one, there's no other listing here. Uh, there's Oakland News now again, because of our coding, there's no other list. And again, other than us, there's no other organization that bothers to try and mention him. And uh, if they would, if they were, they would show up here, but they don't. And so Richard is absolutely right. Uh, the mainstream media tries to steal from him. Um, and he was right to complain about it. But what can he really do? Um, nothing. Uh, I handle those problems in a very technical way that I'm not even going to bother to explain here. Uh, but I'm a believer in programming, and I'll just say it like that. Um, I Let's see if he's updated his account. Uh, and, you know, at, at all. Um, but there's Rich, as you can see. And um, he says, SF Bay Area Media blogger, commentator, KS co.com radio host entertainment media critic devoted to politics media and culture uh he's been at it since 2009 i actually started his first blog uh truth be told so if you want to blame somebody i guess blame me <laughs> but uh i've helped a lot of people who were in media or journalism as they say uh get in started okay um and He's talking about College Avenue here and, and all that. But um, there is, and he has a, a series of retweets here. But uh, Richard also um, has his replies as well. And, uh, and his takes. So I encourage you to follow him on Twitter to get updates uh, regarding oh, Frank Somerville as well as uh, as little humorous takes like that. Uh, like this day in Mets history, for example. But this one uh, says here, and I will co-sign right there. I work real hard to bring it inside to most of my stories and it's no joy to see mainstream media or mainstream newspaper sites owned by billionaires steal my work and he's right sf gate bay area news bay area news group uh primarily and he's absolutely right so keep that in mind folks and best way to support richard is to follow him on twitter and but that's jack's site the even better way to support him is simply just to read 415 Media, his blog, richlieberreport.blogspot.com. All right? We'll see ya.